So we have Loeb uh, 2012 here at the Nokia booth. And here at Loeb, during Loeb, Nokia launched a new product. What is this product? Hello everybody, this is, uh, let me turn on the display. This is the Lumia 620. It's the most affordable Windows phone so far, what has been announced. Uh, it has a 3.8 inch display, very bright display. Uh, also a clear black display, so it's very cool to use outside in bright conditions. Is it, kind of, is it LCD? Yes, yeah. LCD display. Uh, it's white VGA resolution, which I think is quite perfect for the, this full screen of the display. So with a 246 pixels per inch, so very nice. nice. Uh, so it's, one it's gigahertz so dual core engine, so it's a very well performing. 512 megabyte RAM, 8 gigabyte eMMC for user storage, plus SD card. And then you have the 7 gigabyte cloud storage as well. And uh, the most important feature is what we have not left out. So we haven't left out any experiences in Windows Phone 8 or the Nokia different experiences. Okay, can you say which processor it is? Is it the Qualcomm? It's Qualcomm Snapdragon S4. S4 Pro. S4. Or is another S4? S4. S4, 1 gigahertz, dual core, and with all the same networking as the other one? Uh, well, our flagship devices, they have the LTE, so yeah. what we have is HSPA+, Plus, so okay. it's 21 megabits per second. Okay. And we have a dual band Wi-Fi, so 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. And different colors, and uh, what is the color? Is that something you can just exchange? Yeah, let me show you this. So it's by pressing here, very easy to change. And so this we is, have you can a, see how it looks. The... We have seven different colors. And actually, let me show you here. So what we have is, so we have a, what's called dual layer colors. So we have actually molded two layers of plastic on top of each other, and those are of different color. So here we have a yellow layer underneath, and we have a cyan layer on top. And nice. when you combine those, you get lime green. It's not heavier with two layers. It's just no, a very thin no. light. The whole device is yeah. uh, 127 grams, so it doesn't feel like a toy, but yeah. uh, it's not very heavy. Either. Can we see inside behind? Uh, is there a SIM card slot and all that? Battery can change. SIM card slot is underneath the uh, battery. Here's yeah. the SD card slot, IHF. Excellent speakerphone, so we are getting over 100 decibels with certain ringing tones. Speaker phone, which is speaker. Yes. Uh, so excellent. Excellent speaker. Like as good as the high end or? Actually, yes. Even better? It is true. It is the same yeah. speaker. Yeah, the same speaker. So what yeah. we haven't really compromised. We have the front camera, we have the compass or the magnetometer if you like. We have NFC. So all the experiences in Windows Phone 8, all the Nokia different experiences work here. NFC. Uh, nothing is missing. But it's a different S4, right? And it's not the uh, LTE, but otherwise... No LTE, HSPA+. Plus. And uh, this is a wide VGA resolution. Yes. Uh, it talks about SkyDrive here. Uh, how much storage? Yeah, you say? 8 gigabytes. Yeah, 8 gigabytes. And you said, you said it's the cheapest on the market. Did you announce the price? This is the yes, most affordable that has been announced so far. So what was the announcement of the price? It's uh, without taxes, 249 US dollars. Which is 190 euros roughly. All right. And then the taxes. Nice. And uh, available? We are starting shipping in January, starting from the ASA or APAC, and then soon following with other places. When you say APAC, or, uh, that's Asia? Yeah, like Thailand, China, etc. And then after that, Europe and Europe. the US at the same time? or? Well, one, it's got, we are rolling it out kind of one country by country, so announcing those at the time, but the following with other regions quite soon. There's no HDMI, right? No, no, no HDMI. Is there HDMI on the other one? No, no, no we don't have HDMI. You don't do MHL, something like that? Okay. No, it's here. Right. Uh, what else does it say here? Over 14 hours of talk time, 330 hours of idle time, over 60 hours of music playback, so it's, uh, it's good. Very cool.